but I think this will work just fine. I had everything prepared for it anyway. All right, so tonight, instead of wood burning like we initially planned, so I gotta move that out. Move your product oh, placement out. out <laughs> yeah, McDonald's picture. doesn't pay me. Yeah. Uh, tonight we're going to be doing needle felting instead. So this was another one mm -hmm. I, I think we were both kind of looking forward to. This one, even though it involves stabbing with sharp needles, tends to be something that can be done by younger artists with some supervision. I have three kits here today. I have never done needle felting on purpose. I have accidentally sweltered, sweltered, felted a sweater in my dryer one time, but I've never done it on purpose. But both of us sew, both of us have done crochet, uh, I've done different fiber crafts. So while this is something I've never done, I think our experience with different fiber crafts, we can at least bring that in. Plus, these are kits that Amazon markets to teens and the reviews typically oh, okay. say that my daughter loved it. I bought this for my tween. She loved it. So you're figuring that if they could do it at that age, yeah. then... I'll tell you something. There was stuff I could do at that age that I can't do now because I had more patience yeah. then. Or you were probably more forgiving of myself also. too. Yeah. yeah. So I'm not gonna. I'm not one of those who's like, if a kid can do it, I can do it because kids have skills. Yeah. In some ways, yeah. I don't. But I figure it's worth a shot. So um, we have three kits here. This one says nothing about what it is. This one is more of a um, like a filler kit. Okay, so, so it's it, got it, the it includes the, like the, the basic the stuff. Wool. Yeah, this is a multi punch tool. I thought um, because as you'll see with needle felting, it's usually just one needle and you stab it. Right. With this one, it goes quicker. And then we have the big kit. So I'm gonna get a pair of scissors if you wanna and fix the camera. Here, if you wanna open. Scissors. If I wanna open one. Let's yes. start with the red kit. And these were all purchased on Amazon. Oh, it came in a fancy box. It did, like like it's a present. Okay, present. so it has all the, the yeah. felting things. So this one, you can make four little animals. So mm -hmm. there's four different. So this, normally one would throw this away, but this is actually important for needle felting. Okay, so we have all these. What's that used for? You put, put the needles in? No, you put the the roving, the wool roving on this and oh. use it to stab. Oh, okay. So you're not stabbing your hand. Or you're not okay. stabbing your table. Okay, so these, why are they numbered? These are for the different kits? Because, oh, I like this. Okay, so, yes. And this is rather clever because they have each animal and then they have uh, the number this. and they also have a QR code for the YouTube video, but they also have printed instructions that they included with the kit so you're not tied to an internet connection to do this and i like it so i think there's one of these for each of these little packs how can you tell it's thick oh okay yeah i see different pages in there <coughs> okay so we'll have to open this yes you this from is, the top yeah yeah oh. it's um where is it oh, I'm trying to find oh it. it's over here it's right here yeah, yeah. Um, well, in the meantime, this okay, kit so also includes that, the thing that you thing. stabby stab. And it tools. also includes, yes, and those are actually half decent tools. Oh, I see a leather. Um, Would you open that? Oh, it's a finger thing. Yeah, leather finger cuffs. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So you don't. I used to want one of those when I was doing um, a leather finger cut. Uh, yeah, when I was doing cross stitch. Yeah, yeah, because okay. it starts to eat up your finger. So you have, yeah. I bought one of the little ones years ago. Yeah, that's these are cross stitch. It's like a, it's like the finger of a glove is what yeah. it is. That's, those now you nice. could DIY that, that but own. these kits are so inexpensive that. Right, yeah. and then these are little, lanyards yeah. and phone baubles in case you want to turn these into like things purse to hang. companions. And I think this works with the oh, needles. these are tweezers. And these are tweezers. And I think this pin, yeah, this pin, oh, that's actually better than I thought. I thought we were going to just be stabbing with these, seems, but you insert these needles right, into, into this holder. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and then that's like a plug. Yeah. Okay. okay. Not a bad kit so far. <laughs> now, another thing is Amazon, with some of these kits, doesn't tell you what all you get, and that's why I bought some of the tools. I'm just going to hand this over to you this. for right now so we can. And I'll link all of these in the description after. I really like this. 
Oh, the, the, the finger, finger thing? Finger yeah. yeah. So this okay, is a so smaller this kit. This one is just one animal. It might be the, the same company. And there is... Oh, these have finger cuts. These are a little bit different, though, because these are stitched on them. And it also comes with... The instructions. The instructions. How many can you make with, with this? With that, that's a one animal kit. That's cute, if yeah. it really looks like that. Yeah, yeah, okay. good luck. <laughs> okay, and this is all the stuff that goes with it. You get to put your individual touch on it. So that's yeah, the, the way to call it when it doesn't look as cute. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, when mine starts looking kind of catawampus, I just go and like, a comp I'm like, okay, we're not even going to try. We're going to make it look like its own thing. Yes. Might as well. Yep. Can't Better be. to be an original than a failed That's copy. Right. Okay, this looks like it's got hot it's glue. It's got a glue stick, which might have something to do with the eyes. Now, I have to tell you, I don't have a glue gun. Well, I do, but I don't know where it but is. But you'd have to have a glue gun that would fit this stick, yeah. too. Yeah. It would have to be a small so they, we'll have, You might not even... the eyes right there. It's got googly eyes. Yeah. The, the glue not. stick might not even be for hot glue. It might be like pushing something or something. But this looks something. like it's got like a little sticky thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. And then and this you is the don't. What? Oh, wow. That is, is that? the stabby tool. This oh, one's stabby yeah. tool is not as nice. But this also has. The individual needles. So. So this kit didn't come with the little wood holder. Yeah. But it does come with finger cots. Yeah. And the little cots. And these are kind of tight. Yeah. So if you have smaller fingers, yeah. Yeah. this would be good. Okay. And then there's one more. Because like I said, none of these kits said really said what tools. They, they showed a picture, but it's hard to tell in some of the pictures what's in the kit. This so I got a cute this. Little box. This is more like um, just a starter like a kit. Okay, there's a... Wool roving. A oh, 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 what are these? Stencils. To practice with. Oh, it came with some. Snips. And here are the... And there's the, the, the needles. The needles. And it so also wax. came with a... Hot glue gun hot stick. Glue Don't stick. know why. And the two finger cots. And... Those screws. are for eyes. You I sure? think, yeah. This one, Does this one come with instructions? Oh. Felt oh, it does. Oh, and it shows you how to do it, too. This could be oh, scary. Oh, see. That's why we have the the, oh, nice. the pad. This could be scary. So this kit didn't come with the pad. But this 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 thing that you have in this kit mm -hmm. over here is not. I know. For these, I no, it's not because it's already that's got a needle. This, in. this is one for. is, yeah. Because that's right there. How you put it in. A little wooden handle, and whatever this is, I guess we're gonna find instructions. Out. Hopefully, will tell us. <laughs> But this also came with snips, little snips. So, and then finally, Clover makes these two. I didn't get the Clover one. I got this one here. Either. And this is basically a multi needle. And my thought with this is, if you have arthritis, stabbing something with just that needle where you yeah. hold the end is going to be hard on it. This is supposed to. Um, this has a protective sleeve, so you twist it so that it'll oh, retract. It yeah. Let's see. Oh, yeah. So when you push in, the needle goes in. Mm -hmm. The needles go in. And what does that say? Uh, unlock. Okay, so it locks. If you line up the dots. Uh, oh, it got you, didn't it? Yeah. Sure did. It looks kind of reminds me of the thing that they used to give a time test with. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, or the allergy test. Yeah. Oh, yeah, same thing. No, tuberculosis is a time test. So be so really careful because Ooh, that hurts. these yeah, needles, do you need a Band-Aid or some, no. some rubbing alcohol? No, for sure not. Okay. These needles, you're not going to be able to see, but I'm going to show you anyway, have teeny tiny little barbs on them. And what that barbs? they do, and that grabs the wool roving and interlocks it as you. So when you when you're stabbing your little felt felt creature, you want to stab just straight up and down. Don't yeah. twist it or anything because it'll break the barbs. And I learned that from watching the Craftsman Steady Crafting. So if you like crafts, his channel is great. Okay, and it also you can replace the needles. Those separate the two points. But people on Amazon were complaining. Change the needles. Retreat the cover. Oh. 
Joseph, do you want to try making a, a felted? Mm. No. It says if the needles are not used for a long time, the surface can be greased to re prevent rust. Makes sense. Just wipe it off with a paper. I guess a paper towel before the next use. Home cooking oil. Treat the metallic also. cover. Large parts connect the apertures. Repertory needles are sold separately. Introduce the needles and avoid some are above the and avoid some are above the others. Oh, that's that English thing. <laughs> okay, so you can replace the needles. The needles are in here. Okay, so that little. We're gonna do the wood burning outside, and I'm also going to pick up like some rubber finger cots, and I'm gonna make sure I have a trivet, and like I'm just really gonna take it way more seriously. It says how to lock this. So instead we're stabbing things repeatedly. We need <laughs> needles. Safety okay, first, So friends. it's locked in the two. So it will not stab it will not stab if the two circles are not lined yeah. up. Okay. It, it won't will go only in. Only stab if Okay, so you got this where? All of these came from Amazon. Okay, this came over here. Yes. And this came from this packet? Yes. And where did the felting needles? This one, I believe, goes with this. I think so. I'm just going to keep everything with its kits yeah. until we're more familiar with it, and then it's just all going to go in a box. Except maybe this one, since the animals are coded to those sheets. Yeah. Okay, so... Okay. So we're going to look at that kit? Oh, no, I'm going to let you pick which one you oh, want to do. Are they all? Because you are the guest. Oh, do you want to do the very cute kitten? Yeah, right. And my cute one, kitten is, is not going to come out looking like this. This one was supposed to explain how to use the stencils. And that's another reason I got this one, was I thought we could start by doing the stencils. And then we could well, move what on. are the stencils so for? So the stencils are, you. I think if I understand correctly, you remove the inner part, you uh -huh. fill this, you sprounce it. And then to do the design, you lay this on top. Right. And we could try. In a different color, maybe. Yeah, in a different yeah. color. Like, maybe like brown and then with white. Yeah. Yeah, or, or, like or white and pink. Yeah. And then this one, same thing. Mm -hmm. So we could try it with these, although it doesn't include instructions, and then move on. So how do we know how to do it? To one of the animals. Well, this does explain... Oh, these look, this is what they look like under a Where's magnifying glass. Oh, I took it out, duh, Becca. <laughs> the tips of those, okay. those needles. Yeah. That's what they look like. Yeah. That's why they're called with certain names that they are, I guess. Well, like one's a, a thick triangle the needle. The star needle. The star, like star needle. Spiral needle. And fine needle. Good starter needle. The gauge, 36 gauge is a good starter for outline, shaping, and joining. Felts very quickly to speed up early stages of felting. The 38 gauge of the star needle is good for starting, firming, and shaping a good all-round needle. The gauge 40, which is the spiral needle, is good all-round during mid-stages for adding detail and for finishing. And the gauge, the 42 gauge, is the best needle for finishing these hardly any poke holes. For finishing touches, working with a few wisps of wool, adding finishing touches. So the cat okay. instructions. So this is what the thick needle does. This is what a fine needle does. Okay. Wait. Gotta show the. This is what the thick needle, for the same kind of. I guess wool, that's the effect. It's got a rougher surface. This seems to be smaller and tighter. So it's a smoother yeah. Yeah. finish, I guess. And they're also when you're, I guess, stabbing with the needles, uh -huh. it's up and down 
or it's okay Straight to up do and down. an you're angle. Not supposed to twist it. You can do it at an angle, but you can alternate yeah. up and yeah. 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 it up and down at an angle. Yeah, because it'll get one or the other. Break the tines. So something I found in the kitty kit is they actually have basic wool felt instructions. And all, all, all of these, I think, come with videos, except for this kit. Yelp says she's very excited for the stream. She can't do wool, but she's um, always wanted to try needle felting. Are you, are you allergic? I'm, I should say, I'm a little bit allergic to like um, animal fibers, so like cashmere and angora and wool. But for me, I think if I just wash my hands after we're done, I should be okay. Why? You're allergic? Yeah. I'm it's just ir I'm, irritating. It makes me really itchy. I'm allergic to it against my body. Not yeah. necessarily. Oh. Okay. That's great. It's ball making. That's how you do most of the animals is you make the balls. Them. Okay. But this also explains the foam pads. It says instructions to be read at the time of production. So what which one are we doing? Um, I was kind of thinking we could start with the stencils, even though there are no do instructions. Well, you, they have. Um, I mean, but do, you don't. Okay, I don't know. Well, I'll try it, and I mean, then what do you? What you do? can try it if you want. This one didn't come with a pattern. Any patterns? No, it didn't, which is kind okay, of disappointing. But, but that's the, good for us to practice on. The thing made it seem like it might. This one, no, it's not thicker. It is bigger though. This came the from surface. the smaller one. No, I don't think I need a bigger. Surface. Did this not come with one at all, or that came with this one? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's since you got three kits, you can choose your own finger. Something pops. annoying about these kits is that none of them come with everything you need. But what do you do with the hot glue stick? I don't know. It might say here the I put the the rest of the cat's instructions away if you're curious about the hot glue stick. Mm. Why am I doing that for the fish? Oh, Did they not have any fish? good colors for the fish? Well, I'll just do a paw. paw. Okay. Because that's something you could actually you would actually now, to be fair. I did watch a couple of videos on needle felting, mostly because it was a channel I watch a lot anyway, and he was doing it. So I was like, oh, that's cool. Um, and he made it seem pretty easy. So hopefully. And then we can all take a shot at it. That just shows how easy it really is. I don't okay. know. I don't know how easy it really is. Well, we're going to see. That's actually. right. That's what this is yeah. for. I'm a little miffed because <coughs> with these kind of kits, I yeah. usually expect more explanation. This one's got YouTube video teaching. All, all of these books. All of them do. did? Yeah. Okay, I don't say anything about glue stick. So, these are the needles that came with this kit. They don't have, they don't, there's no color coding here, which would be super helpful because these are color coded. And I can't tell which is which. Gauges get, as they get larger, like as the numbers get, Joseph, Doesn't as say gauges, the numbers get bigger, does that mean they're getting finer? Yeah. Okay. I knew it was something backwards like that. I guess the glue stick is to be used to attach some of these things on, huh? Oh, like that would make sense. But the things. thing about needle felting that's kind of cool is you can just felt the needle felting to the next piece. Oh, could you? Yeah. You don't have to glue hmm. it. Here's one of the fine needles. Ah, 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 ah. Need a ball of wool on the palm. Poke out the cat pad pattern. No, this came with a different kit. Where's the cat pad pattern in that one? I don't Bad. see it. Pattern. They probably mean remove the fur and do it in a, in a cat pad. No, it pattern. says... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I poke it out with the needle. Did they explain okay. what this one's for? Uh... I'm not seeing. This is this kit. The what that is. Um, all I ever see them use are the other needles. Needles with the bent tops. I don't know what that is. 
Does anything else have better instructions? Mm -hmm. So this is the gray from this kit here. You know what? I'm going to, while you're doing that, which, which kit are you using? The cat this one? one? No, this, this one. That the has no... Like the bonus kit. That has nothing. It came with this. This one? This instructions. Okay. This so, came with the kitty. Okay. So I'm going to put this back together. We may have too many kits. That might be the... Okay. With the kitty. And I'm going to look at this and see if maybe there's something that we're not... Because they all have that that one with the handle. Right? The one with the, the, the poke. No. Yeah, this one doesn't. It, it has it a weird, cheap plastic. No, no, no. It had... It did have one. I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, it did. This one... Not this one. This one had the weird, cheap one. The plastic one? Yes. Okay. By the world, to the mat, and the way craftsman made it, craftsman, craftsman, steady craftsman made it seem like, is you basically get it kind of in the shape, and then you start poking, poking, maybe poking, matted down, yeah, yeah. It doesn't get matted into this. Shouldn't. I've never done it, so it might. I don't know. So they said you can tear it or you can cut it. You're using. The ones with the curved over. So I'm going to cut it. Literally just wash my scissors. and Oh, that's where they went. Yeah, basically you attach them by poking, poking it in. That one's cute. Oh, it is. Is this the plow? Uh, I guess. It could be a um a corgi or a Shiba Inu. It's it's happy. This one looks like a looks like from Star Wars an Ewok. Oh yeah. <laughs> Does look like an Ewok, doesn't it? I don't know, that I don't know what that thing is. What? Which thing? The the one with the handle, the, the pointy. Yeah, I don't know. And it does start motion it down. I should probably put on the finger cots so that I don't stab myself. Oh, it is starting to go down? A little bit. I mean, I barely started working it. Hey, Joseph, I know you're watching the stream. Do y'all have a good enough angle to see? Yeah. Okay. Uh, your mom is kind of tall. That's okay. I don't mind being a dissing something voice. We're not a dissing. <laughs> disembodied voice. Disembodied voice. It's not a lot of these streams because I have to move around to make sure the camera isn't recording mm. nothing. Okay. All right. Okay. You getting it? It's going. Uh, I find Are you going to be able to pull it out after? We will, well, I'm being careful not to stab it into this belt. No, man, you'll be able to pull it out of that. Yeah, I think so. But these things make it so difficult to <laughs> navigate. I'm going to try just one. Like, they're stiff, they're yeah. thick, but it's better than stabbing my finger repeatedly, so... That's my son in the background. I'm making a gray paw for him. He'll probably try to eat it knowing him. And that's all you do? Yeah. See, that's the one that doesn't have the, um, oh, it does have a needle on it. Well, what is this? I don't know what that is. I this is, really don't know this what is that not is. as sharp. Look. No, it doesn't have the spikes either. You must do that, do the same thing with that one, I would think. No, it doesn't have the spikes. I think it might be for the eyes in that kit, but other than that, I don't know. Huh. And there's maybe there's a video that talks about because they're not showing that in any of these. Do these get put on? This? What? Yes. Yeah. 
that's the yeah. hold. And I'll tell you, the holder is so much better than just holding the needles. Yeah, yeah. Which is what, when I looked at the Amazon listing, they didn't show the holder at all. Yeah. So I was like, well, that's going to... That's, that's going to be terrible. That's going to be hard after a while. Yeah. This isn't so bad. But I'm not. I'm at a point where, like, where I cut it, it doesn't really want to go in. Uh -huh. I should have torn it. Uh, yeah. I guess. Or put it toward the middle. No, that would have been smart. Because then I'm going to cover it with the paw pads anyway. But I think... At least for with the stencils, I think once you have like the basic gist, it's uh, mostly just a lot of stabbing. So I could, this could be good. This could be good for those of us who have frustration and we need a positive <laughs> outlet. Yeah. We don't mind stabbing our finger while we're stabbing. Yeah. Or it could be a good quiet activity. With Might, could be a good mindless activity. Yeah. Just doing that. Yeah. Kind well, of kind of like down. when you used to do the rugs. Uh, yeah. The, the Once you get into a rhythm. Let me try the big sprouncer. This one? Yeah. That's got all the needles in it, doesn't it? No. It's it's all of one kind. I don't know okay. what kind. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, boy. Yeah. That's good for the middle. Yeah. Yeah. How do you know you when you're done? It's about how tight you want it. Oh. Because you're packing now, the fibers. These other things, you know, if you're going to make a ball, then mm -hmm. you want it to be a tight. So yeah. what Craftsman does is he puts something in the middle so that it's not all your expensive. Like what does he put in the middle? Oh, shoot. I don't remember. But you could probably get away with like fabric scraps in the middle. Just a little, just enough to make a ball. It's like with clay, if, when you're working with clay and you want like a big ball right. of clay, you put aluminum foil in the center instead of having it just yeah. be clay. These are all saying good all round, something. good all round. I'm not done yet though. No, please no. It's not done. So how do you know when it's done? Because it's all, excuse me, it's all loose around the edges. I, I got yeah, go to go in and like, tighten them before I... And I'm making sure to tuck the wool away from the felt stencil just so they don't get felted together. You gotta wear a cot on your thumb. Yeah. Your thumb and this finger look a little bit Vulnerable. close. Okay, now I'm gonna do the pink. So what did this come in? Oh, it's got to all go back yeah, in. Yeah, good luck, right? <laughs> so this time, instead of uh, burp, 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 cutting it, I'm going to just pull it. Do you want to try the fish? I uh, don't know. Or do you want to do the cat paw after? I uh, don't know. I'll try the fish. Okay. Fish has got detail in it. Oh. Well, you could it's just like, do an look, empty fish. That's true. An yeah. Empty fish. Empty fish is fine. Well, I would recommend yellow because this kit, I was hoping for blue and green for the fish, but uh -huh. this kit doesn't have, have blue and green. You know. Well, not just that. It, it has a lot of animal colors, which is great. Yeah. But not a lot of... Okay, and then what they recommend is you start out with the smaller needle, so uh -huh. I'll put one in for you. The smaller okay, needle? Mm -hmm. I'm just following what the instructions say. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. No. Yeah. The big, they start no, out with no, the bigger, no. the 36th page. The thick triangle, good starter needle for outline oh, shaping sorry, and sorry. joining. All right. Felts very quickly to speed up early stages of felting. So with this thing, you want to line the peg up like that because it goes in like a cork. And you don't want to push it so tight that you can't get yeah. it back out. Okay. So what... She's going to have to pull off some of that yeah, wool. She yeah. can't use all of it. Yeah. Actually, I'll switch 
you know it's because I'm using the small one. Ooh. Don't want to cut myself. You act like you're a little afraid of it, Mom. No, I'm doing okay with watching. All right. Oh, you're going to have to have enough for the whole yeah, thing. Yeah, I know. I'm starting you can, out. Yeah, you can also you do pieces. Join it, yeah. Pieces, yeah. And I punched in. Right? You need the cots for your fingers because you're going to be oh, punching okay, your fingers. Yeah. All right. Got this one Here's right one. here. Oh, I was grabbing them. There should be another two. one, yeah. Okay. Now, I think this, if you bought enough extra tools, could be kind of a fun craft party for people up, straight up and with down. that kind of inclination. But I don't think you need one on this finger because oh, okay. that's not coming near the needle tip. Yeah, you need okay. it for the fingers that you're exposing to the needles. All right. You gotta try to get it into the corner. Yeah. Oh, straight up and down. How's this felting? It's okay. And this is my first time doing it, so um, I would blame a certain amount of ineptitude on me. I just don't know. I'm just asking you how it's going. Yeah, it's going. Oh, it's going. I thought you were like, <laughs> no. How's it turning out? I was like, I don't know. Okay, I guess. So the downsides to this is you're dealing with sharps. If you okay, so y'all know me. Y'all know I have a younger brother, and if you ask Devin, he will always tell this story of how when I was a girl, he would constantly step on needles that I'd left. I said you left them all over the carpet. So if you have, if you have a child like me, you uh, definitely want to have these picked up yeah. before you go on to anything yeah, else. Yeah, because if you get this needle in your foot, or it's a if bit you have like a, um, a younger brother or sister that sees it and they see you touching it, they might think. That, that looks like fun, yeah. and they could get hurt. Yeah. Definitely get yeah. hurt with those. Especially if it's got a barb at the end. Yeah. Well, no, it has a barb all along the shaft. So oh, if you does it, it? Yes. Yeah, it's not going to be easy pulling it no. out. So um, this is, this I, th I think, kid with the right temperament, because I love to sew, even though I was ADHD, or I am ADHD, it was very relaxing for me. Uh, and my sewing did not look super good, but who cares? This could be good for that kind of oh, temperament. Oh, yeah. I feel the where it catches. And also, it's right now with the stencils, it's very easy and straightforward. Yes. Doing the sculpting little... And you uh, can make your own stencils. Some, the way they describe how to do like the legs and stuff like that. I mean, it doesn't really sound that hard. Oh, you think you think you could tackle it? I say with trepidation. You can do it. The whole point of these streams is not to make something good. It's to try something. Hold it like this. Not like this. Hold it with your fingertips. I think I did too much on the middle beam, but that's okay. You want to try doing the cat paw next? Mm, I don't know. You're waiting to see how mine turns out. No, no, I'm just it. watching right now. All right, you're the parent, mom. Is it going in? How? I think so. What age range would you say is like the youngest for this? Um, I would say probably. Oh, my needle went. You went in. Yeah. Like nine fix. or ten. Nine or ten? Yeah. Definitely not five. No. Not this. Or six. Uh, I don't think they have enough manual dexterity. Because you do have to hold that. Um, and you have to be able to put the needle back in and all that. Yeah, you see. Watch that thumb. Now, 
I can see this one. First of all, I was attracted to these because you make these really cute animal. Yeah. And I like that. I've been eyeing. Oh, everybody likes to hang stuff on their on their backpacks, backpacks yeah. and stuff. So, just because we say, you know, youngest, no younger than nine or ten, it doesn't mean older folks wouldn't enjoy this because the no, animals are no, no, cute. no. I'm just saying that the youngest yeah. because you can make all kinds of things. Yeah. And and not only that is you don't have to make just little animals. I've seen kits in Hobby Lobby. Yeah. Where you can you can do a felted appliques. Yeah. To put on purses Flowers. or to put on yeah. um, you, a jacket. So how do you get that off? Very carefully. It does want to stick, even though I was pretty careful. See. That's okay, because I'm going to clean it up. But this is what we've got so far. I'm going to remove the that base. One. Okay, that's what we've got so far. So when you peel it off the... Which you got to be careful. Okay, so, you know, it talks about the needle for fine that's finishing work. That's the little red, right? That is the 42 gauge that has... It says fine needle. I think it's the, the last it. one. It's the red one in this kit. And you can't see the tips like you can on here. So how's it going? Let's see. If you had other stencils, okay, it's moving along. You could do whatever you want to do, you know. And you could probably get away with this with cardboard or even plastic stencils. Yeah. Another thing is I've seen people make these as stop motion puppets and they have a they make the metal armature first and then they felt around it. Huh. Which I think might be even better than clay because Clay is um, temperamental and has more of a yeah. tendency to fall apart. Can you apart. undo anything that you've done? You can oh. carefully un like pick it off. And I thought the stop motion was a really neat idea too. So at this point, you could probably add some more to your fish, right? Yeah. Oh, you but know I'm what gonna... you could do? You could do multiple colors if you want to. You could put in some pink or um, none of the that fun might colors be, are in like there. That might, be, fish, huh? yeah. that might be interesting. Let me finish off doing my, my yellow. That's a good, a good idea, Becca. Oh, thank you. Or you could put things on like a felt hat. Yep, on a scarf. You could make it into a pin. Yeah. Sew it onto a tote bag. I see people felt these onto existing sweaters. Mm. Oh, you gonna you gonna hang out with this blue cat? Hi there, Mr. B. So let me see what it looks like so far. Pass it. Just pass it. I, when I started out, it's not as good as when I. Yeah, well, that's you know how that is. But it's you it's it's the falling skill. into the shape. Yeah. So. Okay, let me put it back the way it was. All right, thank you. And this is your first time doing it, too. So maybe you don't want the cut on this finger. Maybe you want it on the thumb. Because your thumb, is there one that's bigger than the other? No, they're all about the same size. Look at the ones on your fingers. Is there one bigger than the other? Yeah. The middle finger one looks put, pretty big. Yeah, put, it the, is. put that one on your thumb. Uh, said I, was fire. I'm I know, I'm sorry. Stabbing, stabbing is also good, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, we are stabbing. still going to do the burning. Now, don't I use just, your index finger. Uh, when we Mine. looked into You were using this finger. I yeah. realized we're missing a bunch of safety stuff. And I don't, my brother is a firefighter and I don't play with fire. You know what I mean? Like I play with fire, but I don't play with fire. Okay, so that's what my little kitty paw looks like. Oh, it came out good, Beth. It's, if we can remove it. So I'm carefully just And then what do you do, go back and felt the back of it You could probably felt the back, yeah. That's a good idea. But you couldn't do it on Would that. Would you pass me some pink? 
Thank you. And she cut off as much as she needed. Well, because I couldn't get a good tear. Okay. Okay. All right. I got it off. So we have a little oh, bit. Nice. Not bad though. So what I could do on maybe a flat surface. Or maybe I don't use the round thing. Or something. Oh, good idea. This thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. Is that working? Yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> Or maybe pick it up and do it. You know, oh, sorry, okay. you were grabbing it. I didn't know if you were putting it up or. Yeah. Ooh. Maybe put something under there. Well, the thing or is, I don't want to felt it back to oh, this. Oh, okay. Because um, I'm just cleaning up the back. So that's what that looks like. Never done it before. It's all right. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's all right. You want well, it looks like a paw. Yeah. With pads. Some of these look like they're about to come off, though. Like this one. I could keep like working it. Um, do you want to come? Oh, maybe. Do I don't want to do an anything. An orange and white cat. Like, like, marbled like that, and then do pink pads. Or a black cat. I don't want to use all your felt. This came with this. Don't worry about it. These and you were looking have, for scissors. They have snips, yeah. These each come with pre-packaged. So as long as we don't open one of the packages for one of the animals, unless we're doing that animal, I don't care if we use it up. Here's the scissors if you want them, Jane. <clears throat> Just trying to loosen up the fibers. Yeah, I put. I went ahead and put the largest gauge in there for you. Mm -hmm. My brother? No. He'll be happy to know we didn't do any burning tonight. Hmm. He was bummed. I mean, I'm kind of bummed, but the felting's fun too. You decided to do midnight or are you doing a socks cat? Uh, I guess midnight. See, once you get it kind of laid down, you can go over it with the, this thing to kind of really it in. It. Huh? Yeah. So you can get those uh, plastic foam blocks in packaging sometimes. Yeah. I haven't gotten one in a while, but I I wonder if styrofoam would work. This seems like that's kind of what this is. You no, know, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Like, this is like air cells, whereas okay, styrofoam yeah. is like it's yeah. more solid. Yeah. It's denser. Seems like styrofoam would, would work good. Yeah, I'm not really happy about that. We got three sets of finger cots. Because I can just see I'm going to be the one that's going to the emergency room. I should have. And I've already said. That's happened too many times. No more emergency rooms for this year. Yes, one is too many. Well, no, we're in 2021 now. Yeah, so far it's been one, but last year. Yeah. Well. And you tempting fate. By sliding your feet, so yeah, I'm sorry about that. I'm gonna 
try hard to pick them up better. So you're gonna make an animal? Uh, you confident maybe, enough to make an animal? No, maybe. Maybe. Because I could start, because the limiting factor here, and I'm not saying this to rush either of y'all, is that really what I need is one more of the wood holder and one more foam thing. So you can do that. And this is very sharp too, so yeah. this is good enough to um but I think I <laughs> the cat, I think they're gonna like try the cat the cat's real well the dogs are cute too. My concern about the cat is those cute little orange stripes are gonna be hard to do. Everything about this. Well, they don't use a lot on it. It's do. just like little bitty. Yeah. But you don't have to have stripes on it. Oh, well, that's part of the that's part of the charm. Is how much can I get it to look like Ram? I was telling Deb and I went into Petco yesterday to um. Pick up some bird food, and yeah, you've got uh -oh. the cats back. Yes, and what? Him Nothing. or you? No, I did. I went. No, in. I know, but I'm you, just saying did they you have the cats. No, I didn't go back and look at them. Oh, it's wise. However, and I know no one can control this, but if everyone were to be in good health next year, it might make it easier. To, what? to have a cat. Mm -hmm. Even for Devin to be working next year. Yes. And it would be wonderful if she were not a special needs cat. <laughs> really wasn't that special needs. Well, we accepted her attention deficit disorder because, <laughs> oh, yeah. because that, was I mean, that made her a challenge to work with her, well, but we I, knew like, what the limitations the is, were. The thing about Ram is she was no, she was not worse than other cats. No. Oh, no. Um, In fact, I think she was better than some other she cats. She was a good cat, yeah. I'm trying to think about how I want to. Very see. smart. She was yes. very smart, but she did legitimately have like an attention, attention span issue. of zero. Um, but when you were doing tricks, she had a better attention but span. But I never, because she was very motivated. You figured out food. Well, they say everybody says that cats are very food. Cats and dogs are very food. Well, yeah, especially yeah, that gray one over yeah. there. Uh -huh. You just find out what motivates them, and that's what you work on. Yeah, it's not. I was concerned about adding mm -hmm. the felt to it, and I mean, what the, you looking um, for? Ben. No, do not steal from oh, okay. the because these are for specific animals. Okay. Unfortunately, well, can she steal what them? is the what open I, ones? So okay. gray, this kind of ginger color, black, off white, black. Black is good. Okay, here. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Because and if we start the, stealing um, from the yeah, other okay. animals, then yeah, then you're not going to be able to do the kits. That. And Becca wants to do the kits. I do want to do the kits, at least some of them. I mean, what was the point of getting it if I'm not sure. going to do it? Yeah, this is this is a good tool to go back mm -hmm. and so this kit, the cat kit says, the amount of wool is sufficient. Do not take too much wool at once. Small size of wool poke can add <laughs> wool to continue to increase it. So what they're English. saying is better to start small and small yeah. Increases, yeah. increments, yeah. Once the size of the wool poke becomes larger, it can no longer be adjusted. Yeah. Right. So Okay. Easier to add than so it is to nice and tight. Where's the um, paw things for the? They are around. I'm gonna put I this just don't black have... back in. Uh, there it is. I'm gonna use some white. Well, oh, I should use some white pink. beans. Because Remy had, I mean, uh, midnight, midnight had, had. pink beans. She did not have white beans. Beanie toes. Oh, oh, I wonder what? if they pre-separated the wool roving. In chunks? Yeah, that would be handy for somebody like me, because I'm not the best at estimating Yeah, size. like this. 
So it says, um, step one, the production of the head, curled wool a little larger than one one drawing. Oh, this is tiny. I wish they'd given me a scale. For, oh, here's the scale. The size of the drawing at one one. Where? Okay, so this, this here. So what are you making So first? what you can do, I want you to start with the head. What you can do is you can kind of line it up. You know, though, I got to say. Ooh, you okay? You got yourself? Finger caught time. <laughs> a little bit late for finger caught time. The little plastic ones you can get at Dollar Tree. I'm going to go buy some more because I want to use those with the wood yeah, turning kit. Those would be good for this because they're a little easier to use. Okay, please repeatedly compare. If small, then wrap will continue to poke big. The thing about, about English is I have a lot of respect for the fact that these are people who probably speak Chinese beautifully. They speak, their English is better than my Chinese. But you're not trying to sell anything to them. No, well. Well, but in that I'm case, still... you would work on your Chinese, wouldn't you? Yes, but they maybe they are working on their English. No, they're just copying something that some translator put down. Maybe. Well, I don't know. It kind of depends. This looks like a fly-by-night production, which kind of tells me maybe someone did it. The, like, this is a home business, maybe? Yeah. Why? Because of the directions. The are directions just are on printed. Paper. Yeah, it could go either way. Because I've gotten stuff from AliExpress, and it was done by like a company, and it was very. Yeah. And then I've gotten stuff. It turned out it was just one person working from their home. Yeah. So what is the chef making tonight? He's making chicken fried rice. Oh, oh that'd be good. With I leftover love. Popeye's chicken. As the oh, chicken. that would be interesting. Chicken fried rice. I love fried rice, period. Josie's pretty good at fried rice. Now these photos are really pixelated and bad. So that would be some of my advice to whoever's making these. I, I don't mind the format, but the photos are so pixelated, I can't really tell what you want me to do. And you know, they sell these kits on Zulily, but the better price was on Amazon. Did you wouldn't believe how many times these kits were in my cart on Zulily? So something I noticed. So I wrapped it, but I'm getting like a hole in the head from the where it's wrapped, even though I'm trying to like fold it over. Another thing is once you have the base materials, this could work for certain types of camps because wool roving is not that expensive. Mm -hmm. So once you have the base materials, it's not like you're always replenishing the, the needles yeah. and the, yeah. the holders, you're just buying wool roving. Well, he's cutting away. Yep, he's gonna have bok choy and carrots and celery and kimchi. Ooh, it sounds elaborate. Lot. Yeah, a lot. On that note, I apologize. I cannot keep up with chat right now. Usually Joseph is man in the chat for me. I don't know how dense. Can I have that multi needle? Oh the thing? pokey? Yeah, the pokey. It's right there. 
Thank you. I don't know how dense. How what? Dense this is supposed to be. didn't work yeah I did what I had to do if you wanted to what? I that's ambitious though you could do the bones with white on top of the oh I know it might be a bit much yeah yeah because you have to break off really skinny pieces yeah but I mean you just have to be now to do the back what do you do so I would remove this first, okay. the, the fleece stencil. Not fleece, but. Okay, and then what? You just slowly and very gently peel it off the thing. Okay. It's felt, huh? Yeah. Have y'all been to the farmer's market? The no. New but I saw it was advertised in the guide. Yeah, the the pavilion looks nice. I think it is that big pavilion at the bridge part. Yeah. I was saying Joseph. The weather warms up. Yeah. I think I think the weather wants to warm up. It's ready for it to be spring. Did your apple tree blossom yet? I know it's like kind of. Thinking about it. Well, it blossoms whenever the weather changes. It had buds out when I was over. Oh, did it? Yeah, well, little green buds. It could have been leaf buds. It could yeah. go either way. I think it's probably leaf buds because they lost quite a few leaves last week. I thought it was winter. Mm -hmm, what a thought. I'm trying. I got a marshmallow, and it's a really good marshmallow, but it is not an oval. <laughs> so it's harder to do freehand like that, huh? Uh, I, I have no experience. I'm not much of a sculptor. Devin, is, my brother, is more of a sculptor. Um, I So it's always something I kind of struggle with. You sure you don't want to try stabbing some, some wool? Yeah, sure. I'm about to cry about it. Huh. He was cutting in this. I'm not crying. I'm scratching my forehead yes. and my elbow. I mean my lips. Makes a nice little crunchy sound too. Yeah, it does. If I were you, I would switch to the smaller needle if you're doing cleanup because it makes it easier to do the finer stuff. I st still have a marshmallow. Well, part of the problem is is that I clipped. Oh yeah, it's harder to tuck that edges. In. Yeah. So far, I mean. I'm, the kits aren't bad. We, the watercolor kit was so much worse last week that it gives everything a fresh perspective. So what were some of the comments that you got about, because you said you had an increased number of viewers. Yeah, I haven't checked the comments so. on it. I had kind of a um, hard time last week. Because? A health thing. Okay. So what's that have to do with the watercolor? Uh, it just affects my emotions, so it makes it harder to do extra. I didn't check the comments, I'm sorry. I normally do 
check the comments. I'm just on curious videos. to see what you know what people had to say. Yeah. You just can't take any of it personally back. That's it's some well it's just in what general it is. people are very nice. You're doing a channel. kit for heaven's sake. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not like you designed the kit. Okay, well, this is not about the kit, but do you remember when we did that terrible Spin Masters marker toy and I showed it to you? Yeah. Somebody said I'm just a hater. Oh, I just like to hate things. Buy one. Wait, yeah, it's, it's like, like this buy thing, one. You buy one. This thing was beyond. You buy, you buy yeah. one, okay? And let's see what the hater I, is. I was like, if I can convince one parent not to buy that thing, yeah, then I will have done well. Not a hater. It's just waste I of money. I hated it. Yeah. No, go ahead and buy it. Buy one for all the people, all the kids Everyone that you know. Everyone you don't like. <laughs> but, uh. Hater. This one, I, I kind of. I don't know. Well, you know, there are going to be some people that make negative comments. Yeah. So oh, sure. I know. I'm, and I get where they're coming from, but I also always Buy try. Buy one. Well, no, I always try to be honest on my channel. I, know. I don't have any sponsors. Companies are not sending yeah. me these things. Right. I'm buying. You're paying for this out of your yeah. pocket. So, like, if I don't like it, I don't owe it to anybody That's right. to say That's I like right. it. Kind of like consumer reports. Yeah. Well, yeah. I used to read no consumer, consumer reports. Yes, I know. Even, even the cars and stuff that they I like evaluate. To I like to read consumer reports they don't, about the cars. They don't get them donated. They buy them. When I was a kid, I would read mom and dad's consumer reports for fun. I mean, that's that's the point of you being able to yeah. trust what they Dear say. Dear consumer reports, please hire me to review children's craft kits. You won't regret it. Huh. I, that would be a fun job for me. Okay, well, my cat didn't, my cat probably didn't come out great. It but... probably came out about as good as, yeah, look, look. They came out equally first Mine's attempt. Huh? Mine's better. Yep, yeah, it probably is. Um, Devin wanted to talk about what we're going to do for your dad's birthday tomorrow. And he said he would do the research. Well, yeah. Well, did yeah. you were you on the phone with us when we were looking at the um the golf place? Uh, probably it's so. basically you're swinging a golf ball at a screen. Of course, what and did you think not, it was? The top. What did you think it was? The golf place is a is a range. It's a building on a legitimate driving range. Yeah, but you're and out you in the weather. Out into it. Right. Well, that's what I was thinking. You mean the place on Airline Highway? I don't think no. that's a driving range too. It. I think it's a building with half of. With one face cut off. That's what I said. When I and said you, you drive, right. I mean you swing. Oh, like right. A driving shot. Yeah. Sorry. I meant golf drive, not drive drive. Yeah. Right. But but I don't want to do VR golf. Do well, what, I'm just it? saying, what did you think it was? Well, I can't do it either way. Would you be able to do putt-putt? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think it's still too cool for out there. I mean, it's like when I was getting the gas today over there at that station. That requires a the chip. One? I was getting the breeze from the river. I yeah. was getting the breeze from, from the, the lake. lake. It was cold yeah, out it there. Is. Yesterday was a nicer day, but okay. Well, I don't know how you. Um, I wouldn't up the do back. it onto this because it's just refelting it onto that. Yeah, I would just I do wanna. it on a flat surface. I'm still working on the cabin. I'm still going at it on the fish. That fish is going to be tight, though. Wait, are you refelting the back? I'm doing the back, yeah. No, it's going to, oh, no, it's going to be stuck on the front, and then you're going to have to redo the front. Right, when you, when you do the back, you can't do it against that. I don't think. Just should. like I'm doing right now. I'm doing the back. Oh, I'm sorry. And it's probably what? easier no, to do the back know. with I this. Apologize to yourself. You don't know what's that. I didn't know. The back is probably easier to do with this thing. Oh, okay. Because it only goes so far. Yeah. Yeah, I can see your point. Yeah, I'm going to have to do that with the front, too. Yeah. Just don't do your fingers. Yeah, okay. Well, none of us have done this before, so... Bound to be some mistakes. Yeah. Oh, oh thank that. you. Yes. Okay, at the okay. beginning, the surface right. is uneven. We lay a thin layer of shredded so mine is on the tighter surface on the back and poke it yours. tightly with a short needle to form a smooth and compact... So we probably should have done the back of yours with that. Don't don't do it on there, Paul. You're driving it oh, into I'm the. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Oh, do okay. it on what? Just right on there. the table. Oh, It'll okay. only go so far. All right. You just have to go over and over and over and over it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But it's it's still pushing it in. Right? Yeah. I mean, okay. that's what I did, and it kind of made mine tight in the back. All right. This came out good. I know. I'm, just I don't, don't want expect me to, to do, do it, it on, like that. Yes. I don't want to do it on your table. So I'm gonna don't do more, it. Oh, well, okay, but I have a tablecloth, and I did mine on the table. I so. know, but... but so you'd rather poke holes in your case? It's not going to poke holes in my case. This is not going to poke okay, holes. Okay, here. What if... Here, 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 here. What if you did it on top of this? Yeah, yeah that's good. Did all the felt with you. Yeah. And then something else is we probably need to clean these things after. Yeah, because it will end up gets, in your next it, project. Yeah. Take, I was going to say, take the um, template off. Okay. Now, you may have to use your fingers to kind of move the, the loose strands yeah. over okay. to the middle. Yeah. Oh, you did it too, huh? Yeah. Not hard, but doesn't have to be hard to be like, okay, all right, you win. I just can't. And you're still on the head? Yes. It's not hard, it's just slow and meticulous. Which is, that's fine. If you had a neat little case, you could even take this with you. Like people take their knitting and just get, get lots yeah. of looks from strangers. You know, the thing is, I'm so weird, and I do so many weird things here in St. Charles Parish. Like, we were taking book photos the other day, and oh, I know yeah. people were staring at us. And it wouldn't be bad if they would just ask what I'm doing, because there's a legit reason why. But they just look and make assumptions. We well, don't know that they're making assumptions. That's true. I don't you don't owe them an explanation either. But I don't mind, because if they ask, it might, well, be, if new, they ask, it might yeah. be a new customer for the book. Yeah, if they ask. Yeah. So basically, if you see me in St. Charles Parish and you want to know what I'm doing, just ask. Is it going in? Yeah, somewhat. It's just going to take time. Well, that's, that's the thing that is that it does take time. In there. It's going to take time to push this back into the blue bag it came out of, too. Yeah. The pink. Do you have a bag pink. over there? Is there a bag, an empty bag? But, it's, it's, it, but it goes with the yellow. The yellow. So that's not even the same color. No, because they're one. not from the same kit. Yeah. I don't know where it is. I have jewelry bags somewhere, so if we absolutely can't find it. Is this it? Oh, here, maybe. There's a Here's some pink. Okay. Well, yeah, but I'm not looking for more pink. I'm just looking for the bag. For the bag, yeah. To I put understand. the pink in. Poor child is going to have a very rectangular head. Uh -huh. Want to try a dog? No. This this is not my kind of thing because this is like sculpting. This is, yeah. and I'm not a sculptor kind of person yeah. either, because I want. I want gratification. Instant. And I've results. never, no, not instant, but I want it to look like it's supposed to look and yeah. I don't have the capacity to do that. So, or the patience or something. I mean, you sew. And sewing is. But I use a pattern. I know, I know, but to me, it's also. And I spend all my time undoing and doing. Uh, but you that's know? just life. That's until I get it right. That's... Sometimes it looks a little ragged. Hello, Mr. Bo. Oh, now he's Hello, Mr. You want to come Bo. hang out with us, bud? You come sit on my lap, Mr. Bo. She will not poke you. You're not that kind of kitty. Okay, 
Okay. All right. I'm going to try to move on with this this poor kitty cat. Is it supposed After to be oblong like that? indenting, kind of, but it's not. It's supposed to be more rounded, and I've been working at it and working you tried at it. poking it in all the way to the middle? Yeah. On both sides? Yeah. I've been just going over it. Maybe try using that thing like she's using. I think that's going to mash it is what I'm afraid, because it's such a roundy shape. Technical term. Ah. Okay. And then it says, after indenting the insulation eye with a long needle, am I supposed oh, to, I'm supposed to if that's what this what is. These are. Yeah, I mean, maybe, but it's, and then there's something with scissors. Cut the X, the recess with a pair of scissors for the purpose of burying the eyes, because the eyes are supposed to look. So what, after you poke it, then you kind of trim needles. around the, you trim around the, the hole. Because the, the eyes got to fit inside. Yeah. So I have the eyes see. here. What do they look like? Mm, yeah, because those have to sit inside. So I have to... Where are your eyes going to go? Well, that ain't working. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. I will, I will admit, um, following the instructions and the, um, the, the English used makes it a little ambiguous as to what I'm supposed to do. What does this go with? That went in the other holder. Yeah, it went, no, All this right. one is in this holder. No, it's not what she's talking oh. about. Hold on. Now, um, the needle kit. Where that's the needle kit right there. This is a needle kit. A needle kit. Okay. This is another needle kit. Mm -hmm. So one of the wooden needle holders had a um, needle in it, in okay. addition to the needle kit. Here is here is a needle. Why are you goes, taking them out? Well, because I'm done. Leave it in the thing. Oh, okay. This is what's starting to stress me out. <laughs> no, really, because I'm doing the face. And the face is the thing that if you screw it up, everyone's going to know. You can make funky legs. You can make <laughs> funky tails. You can make funky little jelly bean bodies. But the face is the hard part. Why don't you make the face intentionally wrong? No, that's going to happen anyway. I don't have to try. He's right, but I can't bear to do it because the kitty is so cute. I have to try and make it look like the kitty. I get it. I do too. And I don't think I'm going to finish this cat on stream. But no, I don't think I was you will. Because this is like a like a big thing. As I could go. Now, I took this out. How does it go back in? That's why you shouldn't have taken it out. Yes, I, I realized that. Do you after. want it pokey or are you done with it? I'm done with it, but well, then we can um, she doesn't want away. another one, though. I don't want another one. No, we can just put it But away. where does it go? Well, which where kit, does it which go? kit did this come She doesn't from? know. I don't know. Well, where are both of the kits? Well, no, they all had... I know, and I'm just going to put it in the one that's missing one. Now, this is one. This is a blue... Is this missing one, you think? Yes. Went in that box, huh? This is yeah. you, this is the one you uh -huh. took out. I'm just gonna put these away. If you put this in too tight, then we can't get it back out again. Okay. Well, I didn't put that in. I did that one. <laughs> so you put the the needle in back if you put it in that tight. Get Joseph to open it for me. Okay. Put the eyes up to try. This was not part of this kit. Okay. See, these are individual. All right. That was probably over here, no, over one. here. I'll, I'll, I'll pick everything okay. up after, okay? Oh, 
Oh, these are glass. Be sure to put the whole line into the eye socket. If not deep enough, put, please cut more holes until the hole embedded. Oh, Kit. Please use glue. Glue is prohibited by air transportation. Please purchase glue yourself. Oh, they didn't include. <laughs> so that's not the glue. No, that's a different kit. I don't even have any. Do you have any Elmer's? <laughs> The glitter glue? No, well, that works too. Uh, didn't some white glue come with the bowl kit? No, that's oh, Mod no, that's Podge. Mod, that's I like don't a glue use that. like substance. Hey, it's going to get all over the place and B. Yeah, that's not really. It's going to get all over the place. She needs C. Gorilla glue. It's going to get all over the place. <laughs> I mean, I understand why they didn't include glue, but I wish it would have been. I like when kits say on the outside of the kit what you're going to need yeah. for the kit. So I don't have to open the kit and then be like, oh, I need this. Well, you don't have any glue. I do have glue. I just don't. What is this up here? Not glue. It's silicone oil. Oh, okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. okay. So these are not adhesive backs. That's just, that's just the backs of Okay. Them. I thought that was an adhesive That's back. annoying. I'm going to finish the head, and I guess I'm going to wrap everything up. How long do you guys going to take? I guess this could take. Yeah. How long is the stream over? What? How long is the stream over? What? It will never be over. It's the stream that never ends. Yum, me a Coke. I mean, that's all cute. Some people could probably do a real great job oh, I'm with sure this. Somebody could. Yeah. Well, when I was younger, I could have. I just because you wouldn't have cared if it didn't come out no, exactly. Well, like. yes, I wouldn't have cared, but also I wouldn't have noticed because my attention to detail. It's all those is details. All of these have a lot of detail to them. You know, even the strawberries have little dots on it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, everything is detailed, which I guess is good, but... Okay, that's one eye. That's another eye. Okay, all right. The eyes are... Oh, dear. The eyes have it? Mm. Not as cute as their cat. I don't know how they did the cute little black lines around the eyes, but whatever. Professionally okay. done. But eyes, blah, 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 is prohibited but see, but see, right. look, it's set in. After the wool is torn and folded, it is needed. It is added to the cat's nose, so you make like a triangle. Yeah, it's got to it's got to be up a little bit. Torn and folded. Of course, they don't tell you how much. It would be a very little bit. Just start little, not that I'm much. I'm trying to start little, but well, it you also gets com compressed. I know, but start little. You can always add more on. Um, I have a great big old honk and nose. Small ah. number and many times until the mouth protrudes. So I'm going to feather it a little bit, and then it wants me to do what looks like a kitty stash. Bless, Bless you. you. Come here, Bo. Come here, Bo. Oh, he's in his he's hungry. starving mode. Yeah. <laughs> so that could work. You see that? I mean, it's not thick enough. It's just like disappearing in. But you could fold but you're it like over. Slowly right molding it in but you could fold it over on itself to make it thicker too like here's some tweezers over here that you could use to fold it over it's 
see, it bums me out because I'd like to finish this one, even if it's not perfect. They wanted that but much I over have, that sign. I'm gonna fold it back over. I have no I have so little time this week. Because what do you mean because? Well you make a statement like that. I don't have I mean, to be real, I don't have to say everything on a stream. Some things can be private. I know, but, but you don't have to say it but at all. To y'all, or rather, uh, we have dad's birthday to to figure out and then I have a class I have to teach on Thursday and I'm in the middle of doing a paint review uh -huh. so and then today is hourly comic day so once I'm done with this I have to go back and mm -hmm. draw what we just did for the past hour it's just draw it well, yeah it's hourly comic day why do you draw it because you have how else do, does one make comics other than maybe sculpting you draw what we're doing yes why? Hour, because hourly comic day for every hour that you are awake, you draw what you a did. strip of what you did. Oh, okay. Oh. All right. It's just every man. As I get older, I think I do too much. But as I, I get think older, you do too. everything just all seems to fall on the same day. I yeah. think you try to take on too much, yeah. and then you get discouraged because yeah, I get frustrated. You don't get it all done. It gets done. I just am frustrated. And then you feel like you have no time left for yourself. And you need to make sure that you do some stuff for yourself, otherwise you really will be frustrated. But in a way, all angry. of it is for myself. So it's when you think like that, you're just justifying it now. This does not you know look what I'm right. talking about. This poor cat. Could you help me by cleaning up the table some? I mean, I'm on the. Well, edge I don't of know what here. I don't know what goes with what. Well, if you could the put these didn't... loose ones in here. Okay. That would help. And then this. And did this have cots? Yeah, cots? every kit had a finger. Had okay. Fingers. Okay. Thank you. I think this. What is that yellow thing over there? It goes with this kit. Okay, what is that red thing right there? I'm using it. Okay. And this goes. Yeah. This goes don't wanna... with that. Because this is the that's for the, the directions yeah, for all for the that. dogs. That helps. Just getting some of the stuff picked up. I don't know how to get this back in. So these kits. The animal kits are maybe not so good if you or someone you're buying a kit for, it has to look like the thing because they are... If they're perfectionists. They're, mm. yeah, well, well, there are lots of people who are not quite perfectionists, but if they're going to do a thing, they want it to look like yeah. what it yeah. has to look yeah, like. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, I mean, this is what mine looks like so Let's see, but, it, but, but his head it is looks, It looks like what your directions show. Mm, it's not round enough, but... But but, it, but Becca, you see what I'm saying? It doesn't look like a finished product because no, it's not. no, 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 no. And I don't expect it to. But the photos in this kit are also kind of like misleading. No, they're all blown out. They're all pixelated. It's like they took it way too small on a cheap camera, and then they they zoomed it. They made it. They enlarged it, but they didn't do anything to correct for it. So they're hard to understand because they're full of pixels. You can't see what's actually going on. This shows you how. To put something on cloth, mm -hmm. to Using put the, like like something like this. You wouldn't just tack it on. No, no you, can you felt it use on. the thing. Oh, to do that it. way it stays on. Well, because it basically becomes part of the fabric. Yeah, that's what I meant. Okay, and this goes with this kit. This kit. Oh, this paint probably <clears throat> goes in the box. Add the shredded roll to the bridge of the nose. Well, I appreciate the box that had the templates in it yeah. because that's the thing that we all attempted yeah. um, on. Well, that was the easy, like that's that's a nice box. Keep it, the stuff in yeah, the suit. one of those little tackle boxes. Yeah.
So how's well, the face coming? If y'all will excuse me, I have some business to attend to. Well, if you're going to say that on the video, then I'm going to ask you what No, see, because she's nosy. <laughs> no, I'm not. You I don't are really being care. nosy. I don't, you know, I don't really care. Yeah. I just think if you think you need to say it on a video, well, then you better be prepared to explain what it is. Otherwise, you just get up and disappear. All right, maybe I should have done that then. I'm not expert at being on video. Well, so I don't I'm know not either, but I, I tell you what, I, there are things that I want to talk about that I can't talk about because I know it's on video. Yes. Huh? I said yes. Could also help to do this in a bigger space because I find I'm finding all I'm spending all my time running around and grabbing stuff and then like going the long yeah. way to get back in. So a bigger space would definitely be beneficial. Well, that's that's your next house. Yes. And then it says add shredded wool to the bridge of the nose. But look. Which, look how terrible the photos are. Look how pixelated they are. See? You yeah, can't tell what's pixelated. going on. Shredded. I assume they mean you pull some from the thing and you just kind of ball it up. Well, I think they did one side at a time. It looks like they're doing well, one I did, side. Well, I did the little mustache looking part of the Yeah, face. yeah, yeah, And yeah. then you make the nose taller. But because it's so pixelated, you can't actually you tell how, how they is. did it. Add the shredded wool to the bridge of the nose and poke it tightly with a short needle. Did you see that Verma said he was called some cat? I have not seen any of the chat. I, I'm sorry. I cannot. I can't. Just I, I can't keep up. With see, everything. this this head should have a profile like that. Good luck, Rebecca. <laughs> well, it just shows you how far out. To put the nose, it's not that big a deal back. Out over the face. It's not the face that's stressing me out. It's the legitimate. It's like having to get up and go grab stuff and then go all the way around and then get up. How many and grab times have you done that? Like a million tonight. Where? Well, I must be in another universe or something. I don't remember you getting up that many times. It feels like Why you've been working on that cat? No, not while I was working on But I had to go get glue. Well, or let that, or have the cat not have eyes. I mean, it's choice. Ooh, I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I'm quite ready. Okay. This is just going to have to be back burnered. Well, you ready about to shut it down? I'm just, yeah. yeah. The, okay, so this is so on overall. This is on me. I didn't think it was super fast. I'm not that fool. But I did not realize it that it was it this. Well, it's also I can't get the head shape. <laughs> Just well, maybe you should have started learning. like you said with the general shape, maybe in um, I did the general. Oh, like an under in, thing? In masking tape or something. Maybe, no, because then you can't stab it in. I okay. I would have used like like the the batting they use in a jewelry box or something, but I don't have any. Like cotton. Yeah. I don't even have cotton balls. So, Just so for those bigger shapes, I would say you would do recommend a, maybe do a cotton ball. Start with a base of something else to work around. They have to be something denser, I think, than a cotton ball. Well, a cotton ball part of the problems is, is, is that it's so squishy. It's still you, kind yeah, of squishy. Yeah, you mush your whole thing in. It also doesn't explain how dense to pack it. I would think, I think, if you don't want it to change shape, you pretty, would need to... Pretty dense. Yeah, it would have to be pretty dense. And to be fair, they do have a YouTube video that we did not watch because I did not want to have another part of the stream where we're just watching <laughs> someone else's YouTube. One video like that is fine. So you would recommend that in the future, if there is a YouTube video yeah, that watch goes with it. a kit, then watch it. At least it'll give you a general yeah. idea. It may not tell you how to do everything. And um, so my you other, bought how many kits? Three. 
And because because it's no fun watching someone else do a kit. Two of the kits are like this yeah, one. Yeah, you make an animal. In other words, you make animals. And I looked at the directions on the other kit. It's probably the same the bigger people kit. as this. And these oh, these well, animals them. are quite detailed. So if um, you're working with someone who's younger or newer with this, you might want to start with the stencils. But the thing is, the stencil kit came with no instructions about how to do the stencils. We 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 wung it. We wanged it. Wanged it. We winged wang it. jangled it. We winged it. We we guessed it, and we did okay. But that's well, I, I, not for everyone. I not think, everyone wants to do that. I think the the kit with the stencils. Doing something like that first would probably make you feel like you could attempt something like this yeah. because. It kind of takes some of that initial fear well, away. Well, before, like, a and I stabbed weeks myself ago, several times while doing it. You weren't wearing the finger cuts. No, I was not wearing the finger cuts. So you do really need to wear finger protection because those are very sharp needles. Um, and a couple weeks ago, I did watch another YouTuber do some very big. They were doing their own characters, and it was very simple needle crafting. So it also his videos also made it more approachable for me. Now I can do that. Well, he explained. He also explained some of the stuff that I'm finding that these kits don't really. I'm gonna ruin this cat. I wanted to make the head rounder. <laughs> You're making a scarf. <laughs> wanted to make the head rounder. Cause Why? It's, it's very. It's a very. It looks like a Persian, and to be frank, I don't like Persians all that much. Well, let's see what the directions look like. They're just rounder. Yeah, right? a little bit rounder on the top. And bottom. It's like totally flat on the bottom. I don't know, Becca. It looks like, yeah, it looks flat on, look, this looks flat on the bottom, too. Oh, that's way rounder than what I got. I've got a little marshmallow head here. Well, the good news about this is well, that you can always, round. you can always add on. That's what I'm doing. Ooh. Curled. Curled wool a little larger than the one on John's, Okay. Burying the eyes. Add the shredded wool to the bridge. Did you look? Were you looking at that, or are you looking at this? I'm, I'm on the back now, but I'm just trying to make the head look more like the head. And that's another set of directions. Yes, it's multiple pages. Okay. See, my concern with crafts, especially stuff like this, is if I put it down. And it's not at a good stopping point. I'm never ever gonna pick it back up again. You have to have a good stopping. And that's a per. Point. This that's a personal. That's not like a review of this kit. It's a frustration of my own. So you would have to basically have the head done. Yeah, I was hoping. Maybe not the eyes, but well, the, the head. head the, the shape eyes of the head. are next. Right, but if but now you're going back and working on the shape of the head yeah. again. So you kind of have to be at a point where you're satisfied with the shape of the head. You stabbed yourself. Yeah, that's happened a couple times. Okay, so this is a kit that you could hurt yourself with. <laughs> I'm not bleeding, it's just annoying. Yet. It's one of those it's things. It's a barbed too, if you have skin. if you are someone who once you hit a frustration point, you just kinda don't care and you just kinda do it any which way and you're gonna be prone to hurting yourself more. Yeah. This kit is, these are, this craft is not for you. At least this head's a little rounder now. But see, when I start feeling frustrated like that, it is normally time to end the stream. I'm just trying to finish up the, the head. Because another thing is if I put this thing down, it could fall apart. Well, I'll tell you what. It's good that your frustration shows because if you didn't, if people didn't see yeah. that even you get frustrated with some of these things, they would start something like this and they go, well, why can't I do it like her? I mean, she just, you know, you can, if you can see that other people get frustrated with it. It makes it, it normalizes. It yeah. normalizes And also, it, yeah. it is important to demonstrate, like when you start feeling frustrated, it's time to take a break when and come back to it later. I think that's something that 
YouTube, especially like time lapses and stuff, they know, don't show you that. over it. Yeah, because right, they make it look like they've all done it by the end of the video, the video. right? Yeah. And it doesn't. There's how many times did they? And stop? I'm not blaming other artists, but when I, because I, I'm guilty of it myself. When I teach newer artists, that's one of the things they really stumble. Oh, I'm so sorry, I work so slow, and it's like you work at the same speed. Like that's a normal speed to work at. Oh, but YouTube. Sweetheart, that video was time lapsed three times. <laughs> they didn't disclose it, and that's yeah, a shame. That's right. yeah. But you're not slow, or or people think they shouldn't. So in other words, they mistakes. turned it off while they were doing it until they got to the next point. No, you just you you uh, time lapse. You can edit it to be faster. Because people don't want to watch a four-hour video yeah, or a 16-hour video of watercolor, like the time it really Watching takes. Watching paint yeah. drawing. Yeah, that's what oh, that's I always what turn it off when it's paint drawing because, yeah, who wants to watch 30 minutes? But it's a fine line to walk because videos are becoming, YouTube content is becoming so produced to compete with regular television. Yeah. People will throw immense amount of money at buying really nice equipment and really good sound stuff. And they'll put egg crate all over their house. And like they will buy really expensive computers so they can edit better. And if that's your goal, that's all wonderful. And it does raise the standard for yeah. everyone else, which is good or bad. Good and bad. Not everyone wants to dedicate their life to yes. YouTube videos. Some people just want to do videos and, and have them watched a little bit. And I'm not, this isn't me like complaining, complaining. I'm just talking about like it's important to have your own boundaries for what you're willing yeah, to put exactly. into it. Yeah, exactly. And where you're like, okay, I don't want to do like. Like, there are YouTubers who, their whole house is basically a set. I don't know where they oh, live in the geez. house. Well, I think about it doesn't look like you live I think in about it. these yeah. people that order things off a of wish and stuff Constantly. like that. Constantly. And, and you're in their bedroom. Wow. And they're sitting on the floor. Yeah, yeah, and it's like, this is not a bedroom that they sleep in. Well, yeah. I think some their of them is my bedroom. Some of them might be that tidy. But I think you get more and more YouTubers who will like do a behind the scenes and you find out this is sad. I call it like the pretty corner. Yeah. And many of us are guilty of the pretty corner where you have one presentable corner of your room and the rest is like a quarter's man. <laughs> and I'm not joking. And that I've done I've head. done that too. In fact, my pretty corner is starting to look like a hoarder's corner, so it's time to clean the pretty corner. But like uh -huh. but the thing about that is it is a more presentable area, but because you're recording from home. Yeah. But, the only, but your only reason why you're doing it is so other people. Find it presentable. Will find it presentable. Yeah. yeah. And I've had people comment on my videos, and they're not wrong, but they'll be like, you're, the space you're recording in is so cluttered, it makes me anxious, I can't watch your videos. And it's like, okay, you have a point, but this is a workspace, and I like to have yeah. all my stuff that I need within arm's reach yeah so it's a it's a toss-up and then yeah this is a rental and people have commented oh it would be nicer if you had your art up on the walls well sweetheart i agree with you <laughs> <laughs> my landlady don't want that <laughs> she wants her art on the yes. walls yes so you know there's things that like even though there are things that would make my my stuff look a lot better and i would love to do it yeah but it's not feasible either because i'm in a rental or because i don't want to spend well, a you need to get out of, of the rental. Yeah, a bunch of money get getting like house. a custom build in. And then make sure that you have a workshop in the back that you can yeah. set up as a studio. Yeah. And some people to do, do that too. Stuff. I think that's a pretty good idea where it's a detached <clears throat> area from your home. It's easier to maintain. It's not like your kid and your cats are wrecking it all the time because you could just <laughs> shut the door. Yeah. Boy doesn't wreck your house. No, does he's he? not very no, he's good. Used to be well, a little bit more rambunctious, but he's a yeah, good boy. He's kind hoping of to be down. fed. Well, where is he? He's over there sitting watching Joseph Cook. Oh, okay. Or like like okay, real, real, real talk. I do not know how food YouTubers, people who do cooking videos, do it. I know Emmy Made in Japan has like a separate kitchen, little kitchen area yeah. now for videos. And that makes a lot of sense. And a lot of them also do a hot plate and they cook in another room. Right. But like, 
we cl- Joseph between Joseph and I, we clean the kitchen several times a week, and it, I would not film. I'm no. embarrassed. Like it's not pristine quality. But is that even a reasonable expectation for someone who is working from the home she lives in yeah. and yeah. doesn't make enough money from this to have a? Son? Well, it's reality though, and I think we're so used to having everything cleaned up and yeah. dressed up, and even like the food that you see. In magazines or on commercials, it looks perfect. Oh, that's not even that's like because you couldn't that. real yeah, food. Yeah, well, it's tech- it's, legally it has to be, but they can put polyurethane well, I mean, on it. Yeah, ice but cream, I mean, shortening. Right, right. You wouldn't just sit there and eat a bowl of shortening. Mm, yeah, I don't know about um, you, but right. I mean, that's what uh-huh. our expectations are for it to look. Yeah. It look to look staged. Yeah, and nice, presentable. Well, staged is what it is because it's not real. And I think I think there are some people who do live like that. I knew someone who, before she had kids, lived that Pinterest life. But the thing is, she had a cleaning addiction, basically. Uh-huh. And she watches either. cleaning YouTube videos for fun. That's her relaxation. So she, her personality <laughs> is already geared towards yeah. that. I'm a slob. I used, to have a, clean, I used to have a clean house, too. Oh, but then... she legit had floors you could eat off of. She has kids now, so you can't. You just can't. You'd have to basically you yeah, you'd still eat off of them. You but can. You find your meal. The kids eat them. You find your meal. Oh, you'll get a meal floor. and then some. Now, I'm not saying she's messy, but with kids. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Well. So, I think there are some people who that is them legitimately. Yeah. But it is not real. No, no I mean not that's, me that's them. They are like that. They are that. Well, type. yeah, yeah. They their houses look like they come out of a magazine. Right, as you better walk homes in, and gardens. But they're not necessarily the kind of houses that you would feel comfortable sitting yes. in a chair. Yeah, that. Or yes. staying with them yes. for a week. Or yeah. not even or staying no, with them. Just no, staying with them a half because an hour. Because we've 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 cat sat for them, and I was afraid to sit on anything because I was. It looked like her pillows were arranged in a very specific way. And I didn't know if I could replicate it. <laughs> <laughs> and she would know you touched I'm pretty yeah. sure she would know. Yeah. So I... You moved them. Well, you know, there are different people have different personalities. See, what you needed to do was walk through her house. And, and touch take, everything? Take pictures. Oh, yeah. So that you have a reference. May, that's... I wouldn't stay in there. I was just helping feed the cat. I'm just talking about putting pillows back, too. But <laughs> and that's, that's some... People's personalities, you know. I mean, because the same. It causes so much anxiety. Yeah. Else. Oh well. Ah! <laughs> yeah, well, I'd like to have. I would like to have rooms like that. A I would like to room? have. No, just counters that didn't have stuff all over it. My counters are full of projects that I haven't gotten to. Then y'all see where I it just get didn't it from. Feel like it. In fact, I moved. The frame for the album over to the kitchen table because I'm going to sand it because it's plastic. Look, I'm going to sand it and then I'm going to paint it with look, that latex. You don't have paint. to sand it. What you do is you spray a matte fixative underneath. And that I don't gives have it a too. matte fixative. I will give you some. I bu- I use that stuff. Look, I just want to paint. I could just I use a little. I, I have sandpaper. I have a sanding sponge. The thing I have found is that the simpler you can make projects, the more likely you're going to do them. Yeah, well, it's not that big a deal. Ugh. Big a Cat, deal. Cat, I goofed you! Let's see? Let's oh, it doesn't. Where no, did you goof no. it? No. <laughs> no. Cat, like it until I fixed it. Well, you fixed I was this, trying to make nose. the nose yeah, bigger, Yeah. and I just, I'm struggling. I think it's time that's to a, stop. That's a tricky huh? part. No, well, I'm going to stop once the nose once we're at the at the yeah, we'll be still here in three weeks. weeks. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> three weeks back. Never ending. Working work on that nose <laughs> on the on the cat. She have to build the face up so because because the nose will be so big. She'll have to big, also, build the rest I'll of the face up. I'll also point out not everyone, not every viewer, not everyone expects set dressing. Uh, Verma says I also don't fancy trying to game the ever changing YouTube algorithm or having it become more negative or controversial we'll just to get clicks. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I wonder if there's a happy medium or if it's more like a thin high wire. It depends on the topic you you okay. So I actually watch a lot of channels where they do like um like craftsman where he does like toy molding or resin molding or wood turning yeah. and they can just kind of do what they like to do and they get views for it uh-huh. um that that has not been the fate of this channel but that's <laughs> that, no i mean it hasn't but that's okay 
I'm working on it. Things are. But if you're using better. that as your epitome, no, it's that's not. That's what your that's what your mountaintop but is. But humans it's like, are geared to like to see growth. Right, but I mean, it's whatever makes you happy. That's what it should be all about. Is what makes yeah. you happy. But when you're making a product that people consume, you also have to make a product they well, want. Well, there you go. That's the difference between me and V. Well, yeah. So I, I, I'm not the right one that. Ask that question, or so I mean, I I, I do things for myself. I, I don't really care if anybody else likes them. Um, I would. I am staunchly against against getting overly controversial on the channel for a lot of reasons. One of them is I want people to find art accessible, and if I am constantly stressing people out, then it's not going to be accessible, and then my videos aren't serving the audience I hope to serve. But the thing is, if you're always Seeking to please others. I'm not. Then you're just But I used to, to believe problem. I used to believe that if you just made stuff you genuinely enjoyed, you'd find an audience for it. Um, I mean that was my convention mantra for years. Like don't focus on what's popular necessarily, yeah. focus on what you genuinely like and what you like to do. Well, I mean teach them how to do the thing like this, but make something you I mean you can I make, like the cat, I don't you can make Kara. Do Kara one day, no. <laughs> or do Kara's cat? Do you, you see know? how yeah. how much I'm struggling here? That's because that's somebody else's. No, I'm directions. struggling because it's mold, it's it's sculpture, and I'm just not. I am too type A personality, but sculpture is something I don't do well. No, she's really not a perfectionist, but I like it to look she, at least she close. wants. She she feels like. This is gonna. She's end up a in failure. A no. If it can't no, look no, like that. No, but the thing is, I'm gonna make like with those bowls. I'm gonna make something that I'm not gonna like, and then I'm gonna throw it away. But we followed the directions for the bowls. Okay, we did what it said. The bowls to do. were not our fault because I don't like them because they're flimsy. Even there. But they would be flimsy no matter what yeah. because yeah. Of the materials exactly. that we use. Yeah. I mean, it is what it is. You 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 got a kit. We did it on. Yeah. That's, no, I'm fine video. throwing away the, the bowls. But well, the thing about the cat, my little cat paw, paw. Yeah. I just, well, okay. Maybe this will just end up being a Persian. The, pro the problem is, <laughs> I don't actually like, I like cats with big honkers. My first cat was an Oriental, so she was all ears and eyes and she was sharp skinny. features. She had a, she had a skinny face. I know. I would rather make, I don't want it she to look like sleek. a Persian. Well, I want Persians to, have flat faces, They do, too. and kind of... Broad faces. Kind of ugly. Well, it's a matter of opinion. Everybody thought Midnight was ugly except us. But she was Oriental. I mean, that's what, like with the Siamese. They know. have the narrow. Yeah. I know, but she was the last. She was left at the shelter until I Because they came. didn't know what a gem she was. Or maybe she just didn't click with anybody. I mean, we didn't even know that there was such a thing as an Oriental. Well, that's not why I adopted her. I know, but you realize what a what a I mean you you thought she was a gem. In, about what a real gem she was. How'd you find out she was an the Oriental? Vet. Oh, yeah. oh, she's an Oriental. Yeah, she is. Yeah. You could tell by the way she out. She sounded like a Siamese. Yeah. Cat. You know she yeah. she was black. But Bur she before, she probably had Burmese in her because she had that burnish dark. Black especially color. in the um, well in the sun she looked dark red. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean it's it's a cat that has. Siamese. Some kind of... Or I mean, you can now... Oriental is more of a distinct breed than yeah, it was yeah. 20 years ago when I got Midnight because people oh, we were specifically bred and, and, and it's about traits. it's also about how their their bodies are shaped yeah. because she, she was wasn't long a, and lean. Yes. She wasn't a hefty cat. No, she's kind of a small cat. So yeah. Like, um, like, a little bigger than... Longer than Ram. Ram was yeah. little but Compact. round. Yeah. Midnight was... Smaller, Sleek. she could get into skinny places. She yeah. got a sneaky, uh, sneaky cat. She's a good cat, though. Yeah, I mean, they they generally have certain characteristics, yeah. like the yow. Yeah. The 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 ears, the nose, the mm, sharp face. About that. The, she did the have sharp, kind of face. sharp face. Yeah. And like Bowie, she had little bat, little fangs. She had a long, skinny tail yeah. too. So she was, um, and she wasn't underfed. She was, she was yeah, because she could. She that's ate just, what we gave her, and she just fed her herself. She built. Yeah. yeah, she also fed herself on whatever was in our yeah, yard. Snakes, <laughs> a lot of snakes. lizards. She ate a lot of lizards. All right, I am going to. I'll, I'll try to come back to this cat because I do want to finish it. I do think it's really cute. 
If only it could look like that. No, I mean, even if it doesn't, because it probably won't. <laughs> but cause just because there's some complicated things going on here. Well, it's getting ready to get more but complicated you know what? because the next thing you do. Yeah, that's what is I mean. Put the in hat? Those little, you make no, a no, hat. No, no, no. I'm not talking about the hat. I'm talking about the little the orange wispy, stripes. Yeah, the little yeah. stripes on it, which means that you you might have to twist it. I feel it like the orange them. stripes because I'm not, I don't, they don't have to look perfect like that. I was no, kind of going to go thinking, like, more like Remy. With the orange stripes, you could take some. And just twist it and then poke it in. Yeah. And that might give you some of those defined lines better, you know? Instead of just using But I don't know if, what I'm saying is I don't know if I care about the fine lines because what I might do is make her, make this hat look more like Remy where it covers more of the face. Mm. But we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> see, this is what I, why I didn't want to stop. Because she I'm sounds like a cat. Drop it, and then it's going to get nasty. Looking. And she sounds like a cat. Well, when she does that. Anyway, I want to thank those of y'all who stuck with me. Persevered. Persevered, yeah. Well, let's make a final statement about felting. Um, I think felting is fun. I think when I was younger, I would have really liked this because I had more free time. And this is something that if I'd had like a nice little box, I could have like popped it in the box and brought it with me. Because when I was a girl, we had a sick family member and we went to a lot of doctor's appointments so um i spent a lot of time in the car i spent a lot of time just writing and i usually just read or drew and this is something i could have brought with that's me that's true mm -hmm. and that's it's true. not obtrusive and it doesn't actually make that much of a mess not really um, um this is what i this quiet. is what i think about it yeah um having spent a lot of time in hobby lobby yes in the um yarn section i mean they also have places where you can make purses they have all kinds of kits and they also have felting and the felting that i've seen wasn't so much about making cutesy little animals yeah. it was about um making things that you could oh, actually oh. put on purses or jackets or hats oh another thing and so, with this needle holder so for those of you who are like, well, but that's a sharp thing to be carrying in a bag, you can put it in backwards, and that'll protect your yeah. needle oh, while you're traveling. protect you. Yeah. But, I so mean, you really could pop it in a small bag. For felting like that, I, I would be interested in investigating that, because this kind of stuff... So you're still I'm interested not a in the topic. Yeah. You're just, I'm not, a, type I'm not a sculptor. Yeah. But, I mean, I have felt jackets that I could put yeah. things like this on, uh -huh. or on the collar. Um, you've had felt hats. I mean, you can, you could, you can felt, remember when we knitted those hats mm -hmm. a couple weeks ago? Mm -hmm. You could just felt that onto it. Too. Yeah. So I would be interested in that capacity, but in making cutesy little animals to hang like, off my purse. I like the cutesy no. little animals. Not to hang I'm off my purse. I'm not a sculptor. Purse, but just... I just can't resist cute You know things. what? I, I think, agree. I Hang predict on. that you will get past this. Yeah, I hope so. Because the cat does have a little bump nose. That's, and that's you know, how it's supposed it's, to look. My frustration, yeah. a lot of it is, um, I'm, I'm going to circle where I'm at so I yeah. can come back to it. I think it's, this looks... I know it's going to take a couple weeks for me to come back to this. And I'm frustrated because I, I am afraid it's going to be like... It does look kind of like a Persian. It does. I might just But it looks that. like... The picture too, it could yeah. stick out especially more. to the side. But when you add the little pink nose, that oh, will yeah. that will build on it. So I think, as far as the shape, I think it looks like that. And I Very think my might be a good time to take a break yes. and come back refreshed. Yes. I just don't want to have to wait. If I could come back, if I can make some time, maybe tomorrow and work on it, that's fine. It's my fear is this week is so busy for me. I don't know when I'm going to get to come back to it. So it might yeah. be like a month. Oh, that cat will come meowing at you. Yeah, more about. like that cat <laughs> that no one can see. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. We had Bye. fun needle felting. Everyone, except for Joseph, participated, which was nice. Um, what are we doing next week? I don't know if we're doing the... Oh, Mardi Gras masks next Mardi week. Masks. It's not a kit. Okay. So let me show you guys what we're working with in case you want to did work at home cut this no no i'll explain that later okay i didn't do it it came like that okay so for the mask, here's your other kits over here too. hang on I'll, I'll pick i'm not 
I know. I'm just, I'm just telling you. Oh, we. Oh boy. Jewels. Oh, yeah. Pearls. Because Mardi Gras and is February 16th. Fabric glue. So what we have and, and ribbon. This is a your mileage may vary situation. Because I bought these at Walmart, but your Walmart probably will not have them. But we have some blank mask forms. You could probably order these. That's why I'm mentioning it early. <laughs> is yeah. hopefully they can find like if they want to do this, they could find it. Um, plus, I have just a pack of ribbon from Michaels. And um, the feathers. You could Look use fabric feathers. paint. We have some pearls. We have some stick-on rhinestones, some flowers, Ooh, some peacock feathers. feathers. You don't have to have all this. I just wanted options. And also all And then these different. are acrylic paints that, you know, I've had, I had these. Yeah. But I got these at Walmart. Some of them are glitter. Some of them are color shift. What is color shift? So it's where it looks oh, like okay. it's hard to it's show. Iridescent. Kinda, yeah, it not, looks like purple, from one but there's direction. like a gold undertone. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, we have blue. We will have blue. Okay, there's like feathers and flowers, and these probably have little sticky things, they but do. you probably want to glue them anyway yeah. because they'll pop off. <coughs> <laughs> okay. So we have two masks. Yes. I can go buy another. A third? Okay. Why would you like to make a, a mask? Sure. Okay. Gotta no, take me back. We used to make masks. In, in Mardi Gras, yeah. In kindergarten, sorry. We did too. And then when when I was a kid, we would do the mask contest in, in kindergarten. And they'd put them up around the school. I don't think I ever won. I never spoiler, Becca never won any art contests. <laughs> uh, and then in like Mimosa, we'd have a float building contest where you'd use shoe boxes to build a Mardi Gras. That is true. And yeah. that was fun. Yeah. I always loved that. And what did Dad, Barbie? Barbie was always the queen on the course. floor. Dad, that was, Dad was usually kind of hands off when it came to school stuff. The, the Mardi Gras floats, he'd always get really excited at first and then kind of peter off. And the mom <laughs> would have to tap in. And you know what? She had talked me into doing something oil field related. <laughs> which, I mean, Daddy was an oil engineer, and this is Southeast Louisiana. But I was also a little girl, and I did not want to build an no. oil derrick for three years. So, do you want to do you want to show them the mask that you have on the top oh, of your sure. tree? I just bought. I bought. Yeah, this is one that you made, bought. But you know, if you're looking for some inspiration, you do something like that. I doubt we are, but that's maybe. the same shape as this one. Kind uh, of the same almost. shape. I mean, they both came from Walmart. It wouldn't surprise me. No, no it doesn't have. Well, one. they put felt on the inside too. But. Are we gonna um, put elastic and all that? Our ribbon. This has ribbon, but I okay. have ribbon. If you guys want to cut these ribbons no, off, because these are fine. cheap ribbons. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, so that's next week. Celebrate a little bit of Mardi Gras together, because you know there are people who are going out to parades. And or are they having parades? I guess New Orleans. No, is. New Orleans isn't, isn't having it? any parades. Someone's no. having parades because I see pictures on Facebook. Now maybe in, in maybe Jefferson Slidell. Parish, it could no or Slidell. These or people aren't at Slidell. Or Thibodeau, or Thibodeau, maybe Thibodeau, yeah. Thibodeau's is probably like the Sunday before. I don't yeah. know. I know they have a parade. I'm torn because like I really do want to go to the Lulu Parade, but I have been out in about in St. Charles Parish, and I don't think it's a good idea because people around here. Are not. If we had the back of a pickup truck, yes, that would be different yes, because we could just sit. they, yeah, yeah yes. because because they changed the way we used to go, the place where we went to. It's not mostly not, people. Uh, it is they do do that, but they don't have that ditch anymore. Yeah, it's and so all people flat. you can sit. People park their cars there yeah. now and sit in the back of the cars or trucks. Yeah, or they park them lengthwise. Yeah, and, and anyway. Yeah. Well. Maybe next. I do want to go to parades, just maybe not this year. But we or maybe if Devin rides in one of the fire engines, you might want to go with him and you could do the wave. Having fun. Go waving. <laughs> Take a picture of him. Yeah. I did that last year, so. But one more thing. Huh. While I, I mean, I only got two people watching, but I might as well plug it. Two people. She's going to catch you both. <laughs> Mardi Gras promotion this year. Oh, she got some more masks. Oh, okay. I know why she's got the masks. I know why she's got these doubloons. Although they don't look like any doubloons I ever caught. Maybe they're making them like this now. 
Oh, such sad days. And necklaces. And, ooh, look at that. Oh, pretty. Oh, yeah, this. that's a good one. Look at that king cake. So, that looks good. So, back. what I'm doing is I'm doing a Mardi Gras promotion so people near and far can celebrate Mardi Gras at home. I wish I could send y'all a king cake, but that always gets crazy expensive. So, there will be an item in my shop soon. I need to get on it where you, it's the Mardi Gras package. You'll get volume one, volume two of Seven Inch Care because they're set in Southeast Louisiana. You'll get Lilliputian Living. You will get a postcard print of the Mardi Gras illustration so you can send it to someone or you can put it up. You'll also receive two masks, some doubloons and some beads so you can throw your own parade at home and celebrate Mardi Gras this year in a safe way. So there'll be more information about that up on the site and I'll probably do a little mini video about that as well. Are you ever going to do anything with this? I have no idea. Why? Well, I, I see you eyeing it. No, I'm, I'm just saying because um, you're going to, I mean, you're giving away postcards. Yeah. But like That'd you could sell. Right. I was thinking about the offering the original, yeah. either selling it or doing a raffle or something. Yeah. But something else I'd like to do eventually, eventually, is I'd like to see if some of the coffee shops or maybe the library would be interested in hosting some of my art. Don't just to help wrong. decorate. Well, the thing is, it's COVID. Nobody's coming in, so there's no point. I don't know. There was a thing in the guide about the, the library and all it had to offer and stuff like yeah. that. So. I mean, um, me and Miss Leslie with the St. Charles Parish Library have talked about that, but uh, we also talked about doing it after COVID yeah. when more people could come in. Because well, I, I got ideas. Next summer. I got ideas. I want to do, like, fairy doors except they're Lilliputian houses and then hide them in the children's section of the libraries uh, and if they would let me do that. We dive in her back. Yeah. And then maybe have it as a scavenger hunt where you follow the doors and you find something a little more magical. Yeah. And it would be cute. Yeah. So, anyway, thank you guys for joining us. We'll see you next week when we make some art. Joseph! What? You want to make a mask? Make a mask? A Mardi Gras mask next week. Uh, I don't know. I'll buy one for him and we'll see. Say yes. I'll buy him a mask. So we'll be doing Mardi Gras masks next week. And uh, I'll see you guys then. So have a wonderful, safe, and happy week. Bye. Bye, guys.